So a couple days ago, I was walking towards my room and I found something interesting. That's why I wanted to share on the YouTube. You know, since this is the first experience for me and the campus theft is really popular among United States, I wanted to make this video to make sure like nobody, like literally nobody has that experience like me. Yeah, that's right. My bike is stolen and this is what I did. So the first checklist, if your bike is stolen, you gotta talk to the police. Call to the like local police department and make sure that is like non-emergency one. You gotta talk to the police and you have to file the police report to make sure nobody has the same experience. If you need an officer to respond or you need to file a police report, press 1. Thank you for holding, sir. So it occurred two days ago and you said that they have video footage of it? Yes, we have. They're gonna ask you like literally everything and exactly what happened, like tiny details, like what color is your bike, or what time is your you know theft is happening, or is your bike is insured, is there any serial number in it? Literally everything. And you have to tell them everything to make a police report. So once you talked with the police and they made the police report, they gonna tell you whether there's a, like progress or not, meaning whether they catch the theft or not. Most likely, like 75%, it is unable to catch the theft, but it is still meaningful to report to the police and make a police report. I'm sorry to hear that your bike is stolen. I reviewed the camera footage and I was not able to identify the individual either. The next step would be the police with this if you'd like. Okay, then here's the camera footage. Uh, this is really, really awesome and helpful uh, once you're like, you know, dorm or someone supporting you or providing the, some sort of footage. In that way, I can contact with my insurance company or the police department to find that I can attack or someone who stole my bike. So at least this is a great progress, even though if I cannot find a theft. So let's make sure, even if your bike is stolen, this unlikely your bike is gonna get back to you. I'm sorry about it, most likely not. But still, you might get the money back. Like in the California law, if the petty theft is happen with the value like 950 or less, the theft, they can go to the jail for six months or they can be charged for a thousand bucks or both. However, in this situation, like in this particular situation, the theft who stole my bike, he put the mask on and the food is on, so it is really hard to identify who it is. And in this building, we need to get the key to enter the building, but this theft didn't use the like key to get into the building, so it was super hard to identify who it is. And the last checkpoint is, let everybody know about it. Like on the Discord or social media like Instagram and Twitter, let everybody know who stole your bike and who it looks like and like alert everybody like this is a man or a guy who stole my bike. So everybody please be careful and you know you gotta do or you gotta get your chain or you know be secure everything you have to do so that's all for today thanks for watching this video and if you know myself you know someone who stole my bike is watching this video could you please just give me back my bike because i really need it thanks for watching this video and hope i see you next time